Last couple of weeks in our Voices of Valor series, we have been honoring the veterans, the heroes who fought back oppression and saved our world now that it is the 75th anniversary of the end of World War II. But what are the ways we can flip the script now and pay it forward to them, the tangible ways we can honor them and give back to them? Well, I spoke to one veteran who's on the edge of his seat waiting to take an honor flight. I'm, I'm, looking, I'm, I'm looking forward to it just uh, like I said, been in the area before, but this would this be something, something completely different. John Burroughs is an Air Force veteran living in Jacksonville Beach, all signed up and ready to go on his honor flight. An amazing program that takes veterans on a flight up to Washington, D.C. for free to see all the monuments and memorials built in their honor. I thought it would be, I thought it would be an honor to sign up and go on the uh, honor flight. It's a program that's been around the country for 15 years. And in years past, Mr. Burroughs would have had to drive hours out of town. But the First Coast has never had their own chapter. And for some reason, there just has never been a chapter or hub in Northeast Florida. Uh, as you know, Northeast Florida has a huge veteran population. Selena Hernandez Haynes is a retired Navy commander herself and is playing a key role in starting the Northeast Florida chapter of Honor Flights. You know, they answered the call. You know, they wrote a blank check to the country. But the timing has been tough. With our World War II, Korea, and even Vietnam veterans' ages, the time to go is now. Unfortunately, they haven't been able to. You know, we started at an interesting time and the coronavirus pandemic prevented us from flying in this year, 2020, but we are very hopeful and planning for two flights in 2021 when the public health situation allows. Because it's the very least the community can do for vets like Burroughs. And when they get to see it, the, the look on their faces is indescribable. And always a character, Mr. Burroughs says he's looking forward to it for other reasons too. With me rolling around in a wheelchair, and I'm gonna have a young lady to, to uh, push, me, push me around or not. So if you would like to give and make these honor flights possible, just visit the website firstcoasthonorflight.org. It is something we have desperately needed here on the First Coast for such a long time now, and thanks to these volunteers, it is possible.